No. You mentioned uh, the chip shortage, and Micron was a story last oh. night. Uh, Pre-market uh, this morning, uh, down despite that better than expected quarterly number, upbeat guidance amid tight supply and strong demand for memory chips. Uh, do not miss an exclusive, by the way, with Sanjay Marotra later this morning on Tech Check. You have him a, too. Eleven. Is there anyone that, that, that I don't that I used to come on Mad Money? Don't you have another guest who's amazing today? I'm sure we do. Yes, could be any Perfect. of them. San, I love Sanjay. Sanjay did. You know, Sanjay said the exact wrong thing. He gave this statement. Excuse my uh, readers here. He said, I love Micron's business is healthier, more robust than ever. Well, that's the, you know, that is the duck coming down. By the people, way, those have a light on them if people want to know. Will you turn the light on? I, I lo- oh, I love that. That's my favorite. <laughs> what, oh, what are you, you going to do not, some they're mining? They're actually reading this SPAC report. <laughs> Um, you know, this is what... It's this like is, going to the dentist. It's uh, it is. It is like going to the dentist. <laughs> it's oh, my God. It's backwards. It's unbelievable. He's, See he's, got, the devil. he's actually got them taped up, too. I mean, those, these... I got to play. Holy what? To be, to be fair, his Jim, your report is like the two... The font size. Because <laughs> one went out, you know? Yeah. You look I leave more very small print I leave on more. this. This is like me. Better. I got a molar this that is I me could use a little work on at there. This is me looking at the GSK, uh, uh, their, their vaccines. But it, what happened here is basically that uh, a lot of people thought, saying you got to ask Sanjay, that he was going to say, look, demand is so overwhelming, it doesn't matter what we can do. And there's been not enough machines being made for in order for us, for us to be able to meet demand for NAND or DRAM. And he was pressed several times, and he did not go there. So a lot of people are saying... That Sanjay, who can be promotional, but I happen to like him very much, did not give you what you wanted. And they tried and tried and tried. I suggest you try again. I bet you he recognizes that he was too negative on the call. Uh, two other bullet points on chips today. Uh, we mentioned AMD getting some EU clearance on right. Xilinx, five month high over there. Today, NVIDIA, uh, who goes to the street high? It's uh, BMO. BMO, $1,000. That's just unbelievable because they're actually talking about. A company that's going to have $32 wow. billion dollar business in just uh, in data center. And by the way, can we just say we got to go back to what happened with Intel yesterday when Intel said Sapphire not ready? I mean, that means I think that Intel is now two iterations behind AMD. And that's why, I mean, Lisa Sue, look at that stock. Do you know when Lisa Sue, when uh, Gelsinger came on Mad Money Man. and was basically saying, listen, we've caught Lisa Sue? Uh, she didn't come on air and say, hey, no, that's not the case. Uh, she just said, I, you know what? I'll just keep doing my job and let's see what happens. This is the part of the show where I tell you how well you've done in terms of recommending both these stocks for at least the last five, wow, seven nice. years. Can we put both? I'd love to see a, a advan- a AMD versus NVIDIA five years. I mean, both that's charts a, are incredible. Well, that's a foot race. But that might be a foot race. That is yeah. really, can we do that? See, I mean, they look, they're, they're the same. Look at that. Look at yeah. the performance. That's, in that, that's, of course, when Lisa Sue came in. Yeah, there they are. Right, so, look, wow. It, they actually are. They are fairly close in terms. Well, because they're the boy. two two of the greatest so, companies in America. You know, say what you want, but uh, Jim, you've been dead on. You haven't let off. By the way, I mean, even Moss's son sold all. Remember when they owned a lot of Nvidia and then they sold it? Now they're trying to sell ARM to Nvidia for well, Nvidia stock. Look, if, but if uh, Jensen gets a lot of ARM, people made made mistakes in selling Nvidia along the way here. Yeah, not me. Um, I did, all I did was when our dog Nvidia died, I got another dog, and it's Nvidia the second. And by the way, I, my, the pass for NVIDIA second is coming. I saw the actual, I got a snapshot of what it looks like. You'd be able to walk into that. No one can get into NVIDIA's headquarters, except for my dogs. <laughs> got it. NVIDIA, by the way, uh, is when they're going to solve self-driving cars. They don't talk about it. It's black ice that's the problem. And Jensen is going to get, he's going to solve black ice. Did you know that it's black ice that's the problem? I did not know. Uh, cars, I could cars imagine not, a number of different problems. Jensen but they can't showed me. He said that. they can't. Cars right now can't detect black ice. It's one of the things they can't. But that's the main worry. They don't talk about that at Waymo. I'll tell you, uh, human drivers don't exactly have a little yeah. easy time with black ice if, either. If you were going to make a car right now, would you ever to start struck up? Would you ever have a human drive it? No. No. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.